I work in a cemetery. That's what I say to people. I just spare them the details because nobody would understand or even believe me. This is a place where people bury their loved ones, but I think it's just a waste of space. My job title is too unusual and too gruesome for most people. If they ask, I say I'm an undertaker. But really, my job's a little different. The undertaker prepares the bodies for burial, puts them underground. It's my job to make sure those bastards stay there. Got another one for you, near the south gate. All right. I'll get it when I'm finished with this. You better do it before the brain's dry. They're all over the tombstone. I hate it when you do that, Lloyd. Why do you have to make it so hard to clean up? You want to switch? You do the killing and I do the cleaning? Nah, I didn't think so. It's just those corpses you butcher. They have families. Why can't you have any respect? They're dead. Yeah, and our job is to put the dead back where they belong, not make gore masterpieces. Just destroy the brain and bring them down in the most efficient manner. I think I made pretty efficient work of that last one. If you get off your skinny ass and go take a look. You didn't need to hit him so many times. I only hit it once. <laughs> there wasn't even anything left for a second hit. Well, maybe you shouldn't use that shovel. What do you want me to do? Hit him with a book? I I'm not criticizing you, Lloyd. It's just there there's got to be a less barbaric way of doing this. Look, this is how we always do it. We used to use guns, but they disturbed the locals. You got a better suggestion? I'm all ears. Let's just go to the shed and find something else. There's got to be a pick or something sharp. Hey, what's this over here? Lloyd, leave that alone. Funeral's tomorrow. Look at this. Look at all this jewelry. Nice suit. Why is he dressed so proper? Like he's going out or something. Come on, Lloyd, that's enough. Then there's a pillow? Why? So he can get a nice rest? If they're trying to make him comfortable, why don't they just give him pajamas? So, is he going out? Or is he going to bed? I don't know. But how a family chooses to honor the memory of a loved one is their own business. It's a personal decision, and however it gives them emotional value and support, that's all that matters. What's your point? My point is you have no respect for the dead. Fuck the dead. Boy, easy! Hard. 
bitch. How are we gonna explain this one? I sure hope it's a closed casket funeral. Gonna have to be now. I'll clean up everything tonight. No, you won't. Yeah, I will. Starting right now. Batter up, bitch boy. You okay, Earl? Yeah, I'm good. You all right? I'm fine, man, but there's a shitload more of these pecker heads on our way. Oh, fuck me. We better get to the shed so we can get something to kill these sons of bitches. Let's do it. Here. Use this. It always works for me. Let's show these decaying cocksuckers what we're made of.
Lloyd, seriously, what's the deal with that one with its head up its ass? Oh yeah, I guess I was feeling a little creative. Whatever. Let me ask you a question. Are we going to be doing this our whole lives? I don't know. I guess you could get another job. How am I supposed to even look for another job? when I work from dusk till dawn, and then sleep all day. Well, here's how I see it. We are what we are. We didn't ask to get put into this. Who knows why us? Who knows why it's only this cemetery? Who knows why it only happens at night? What matters is that we have some kind of purpose. A responsibility. Making a living killing the dead? Hey, it's a gruesome job, but somebody's got to do it. Oh, we better finish this. Visiting hours are real soon. See you tomorrow. Tonight. My friend's right. Work sucks. We do the same damn thing every night. What does it all come to? Nothing. All I have to look forward to is death. So I might as well try to enjoy life, right? But how can I when I feel just like the walking dead? Call it power windows for nothing, you zombie piece of shit. Thank you. 